Hi guys and welcome back to the channel. Today I'd like to present you this headlamp from Felix. As you can see we have some specifications here on the box. So the beam distance is up to 120 meters. It's water resistant. It has up to 9 hours runtime and it has 5 light modes. And as you can see it's also quite bright at 330 lumens. And we also have a sign here saying that it's hand free, uh, meaning that it has a sensor. And the most important thing is that it is rechargeable, meaning that you don't need batteries, you just need to charge it from time to time. This is how the box looks like. It's very compact. And it's made in China, of course. Yeah. Yeah, made in China. Okay, let's see what we have inside the box. So we have the product, we have the charging cable and the user manual. The charging cable is micro USB. But if you have a phone charger, I think you are good to go. Let's have a look at the user manual. It's very small. Okay, it's in multiple languages. And here, as you can see, we have some technical specifications. So it has 330 lumens. The beam distance is 120 meters. Runtime is between 105 minutes and 9 hours. So between 2 and 9 hours, depending on the mode, probably. It's water resistant. It's also shock resistant. Charging times take 3.5 hours. And the battery is 1,800 milliamps. And here we have a description of the product, a light control button here, red light, red light, sensor for on off and charging port on this side and COB light, I don't know what COB means. Okay, let's have a look at the product. This is how the product looks like. The product looks of a very good quality, the materials are very soft, I like it, this is really soft. Okay, the band looks okay, this is from where you adjust the band, okay. Here we have plastic, here we have rubber, we have two buttons here, power on button and the sensor button. It has a movement sensor, so basically if you press this button, when you move your head, the light will be on. This is the charging port. As I told you, it's micro USB. Okay, here we have the COB light, here we have the main light, and here we have the red lights. Yeah, and it's adjustable, so basically you can change the angle of the light if you want okay now as I told you it has multiple modes so if you press this button very fast it's, it, will it will change the mode so this is the main beam this is low intensity this is blinking this is the red light uh, okay you need to press very fast so this is the red light and this is red light blinking and these are all the modes if you want to use only the cob light you need to press this button for a few seconds like this and now the cob light is on this is a very i'd say dim light it, it doesn't have very much power but i think it's mm, i don't know why would you use that anyway it's good to have it uh, okay, and you, if you want to switch this off, you need to press again, to press and keep it pressed. And now, uh, if you press this button for a few seconds, you will see the level of battery like this. As you can see, it has four lines out of five, so it's almost fully charged. 
Uh, and if you want to activate the sensor, you just need to short press this button. Now the sensor is active and when you move your head, it will switch on. But right now it's uh, light in here and, and it's not working properly. But as you can see, yeah, it's working. Because it's also a movement, but also um, a light sensor. So it has to be dark and in the same time, it, you have to move your head. Okay, and if you want to turn off the sensor, you need to press this button. Now I'm going to charge the product with this Samsung charger. As you can see, it has 5 volts and 2 amps. It should work, so I'm going to plug this in. Okay, and as you can see, the battery indicator already started to blink. As I told you, it had 4 lines when I bought it, and now as you can see, is charging the fifth line so it will be fully charged and this is how it looks when it charges so if you have a phone charger it should work i don't think it will work with a, a fast charger the latest generation for example the 45 watts uh, that i'm using for my samsung galaxy s23 okay guys I'm going to take it outside when the night will come and I'm going to test it to see how it performs. Okay guys, so right now I have the headlamp on my head. As you can see, this is the beam. It's okay for, I'd say up to 50 meters. And over there it's a house at 150-200 meters the beam is very focused and it goes quite far yeah the tree over there the distance is around 40-50 meters Yeah, look, for, for my needs it's okay, I really like it, I think it performs quite well. Okay guys, this was my short review of this product, I'm really happy with it. Again, Philips quality is one of the best and I'm happy with their product. I bought it for around $20 and I really believe that the price, it's a good price for this kind of product. Of course, you can find cheaper Chinese products, but the quality is not as good as this one and again the light intensity as you saw It's very good. If you like this video, please subscribe and hit the like button. Thanks for watching